Inside EastEnders icon Steve McFadden's quiet life away from Phil Mitchell. Phil Mitchell has been part of some of EastEnders' most chaotic and memorable storylines since the 90s, but what is life like in the real world for Steve McFadden? Phil Mitchell is arguably the most well-known character in EastEnders, even if you've never watched a single episode, you'll have likely heard the name. Actor Steve McFadden joined the popular BBC soap opera in 1990 and has starred in some of the popular program's most memorable scenes. But aside from Phil's fictional life on screen, not a lot is known about the man behind the beloved TV personality. The 63-year-old from Maida Vale has worked on EastEnders for the last 33 years but still maintains a low-key life, far away from social media. His character has cheated death and had dozens of wives and girlfriends and the drama is non-stop for Mr. Mitchell, but away from the cameras his life appears relaxed as the now father of five couldn't live a more polar opposite reality, here the mirror looks at Steve's world before fame, his family, and net worth. McFadden, from Westminster in London, has worked several jobs since leaving school as a teenager, including working at a builder's merchant, plumbing and, bizarrely, carrot picking. It was his next move that altered history, and without it, we'd never have Phil Mitchell. Luckily for EastEnders fans, Steve decided to go to university and then studied acting at the Royal Academy of Dramatic Art in London, he landed his first acting gig in 1987 in the film The Firm before joining EastEnders in 1990. Joining forces with Ross Kemp, the pair was cast as brothers Phil and Grant Mitchell, with the late dame Barbara Windsor playing the boy's mother, Peggy Mitchell. Steve has since won several awards, including Best Soap Actor at the Inside Soap Awards, as well as Outstanding Achievement Award at the British Soap Awards in 2016. Since EastEnders was released, fans have been curious as to how much the soap stars really make for playing their iconic characters. It was in 2006 that some of the actors' salaries were leaked and Phil Mitchell's pay packet was revealed. Reports at the time suggested Steve was being paid an annual salary of £360,000, yet he still continues, to this day, to arrive on set on his humble moped scooter. His salary was reported to be even higher a few years later and he's now thought to be worth £2.9 million, according to Celebrity Net Worth. Real Life Family As for Steve's real romances, he previously had a high-profile romance with co-star Lucy Benjamin, who played Lisa Fowler, in the early 2000s. The pair began dating in 1999 and lasted for four years before calling it quits in 2003. Away from the square, Steve has five children, with his youngster being born in 2016. Steve's family has grown over the years. His eldest son, Matt, who is now thought to be in his mid-thirties, was born from his relationship with his childhood sweetheart, Sue Marshall. Later on, he expanded his family further by welcoming two daughters, Tiona and Molly Jane, with a previous partner, Angela Bostock. In 2009, Steve became a father once again when his then-girlfriend, Rachel Sidwell, gave birth to their daughter, Amelie Tinkerbell. However, their relationship was short-lived, and they decided to part ways just two months after Amelie's birth. In June 2016, Steve celebrated the arrival of his fifth child, a daughter named Frankie, with his long-term girlfriend, Karen Cairns. It is believed that Steve and Karen are still together and continuing their journey as a family. Thanks for watching this videos. Please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.